How you doing guys? Ruben here with uh, Tarp System in East Dundee. We're a trailer dealer and we sell trailers like this. I'm going to show you why this is one of the best trailers on the market. This specific unit, it's a extreme trailer with a load covering solution tarping system on it. And let's go show you the features. Number one, we're going to start with the door in the front. This has got a three point closing mechanism at the bottom, in the middle, at the top. It's pretty sturdy door. You can see it's not flimsy, it's good quality. Another good thing that load covering solution does, it's they mount the bulkhead about four inches in the front of the trailer. This helps you with getting a little more room in, inside and then it also helps the space between the truck and the trailer to be at minimal and then your aerodynamic it's much better like that. This extreme trailer is the lightest trailer on the market. The trailer itself is 9,000 pounds. With the Conestoga system and the ramps, this specific unit, it's 11,500. Without the ramps, you would be at about 11,250, which is very, very light for a 53 system, full aluminum trailer, load covering solution with extreme. Coming to the rail. Why this is, in my opinion, one of the best rails, I think it's the best rail, because this outside edge here, it's very strong aluminum, and you're not gonna be able to bend the track. And it's very important for you when you're down on the road and you go to a shipper, they bump into your rail, they can damage your track and you're gonna be stuck over there. You're not gonna be able to push the system, close the system, and you're gonna be stuck. Well, with this, it's, it's built stronger, so it is going to protect the track. Now, on the tarp side, it's pretty much similar like everybody else. This is a 20 ounce vinyl tarp. Um, it's it's kind of standard across the board. I'm gonna show you uh, the, the trailer, obviously, full aluminum, as you can see that. Um, this is a narrow neck trailer, so it is a little lower to the ground and we're able to install a higher tarping system on it. This unit has got 104 inches inside height and it's 102 wide. Continuing, uh, we've got some uh, heavy duty ramps that we installed. This is fairly unique, you don't see that every day. Uh, the reason is the trailer being lower to the ground you're able to use those ramps those are uh, 14 foot ramps and you're able to use those ramps to load cars suvs forklifts equipment anything like that on wheels or tracks you're able to use those ramps those are rated for 24,000 pounds total let's come towards the back those are winches on this side we have also installed a scale and we can get it we can get it for you too uh, this you're gonna save money it uh, you're not gonna have to go to the trucks up so often so you check right on the spot you check what's your what's your weight on the trailer and you don't need to spend money at the truck stop we got good tires we got the tire inflation that I talked to uh, I talked about in the front um, in our opinion this is a must you gotta install the tire inflation because Nowadays, drivers don't want to check the tire pressure every morning and who does it? Nobody does it. So this is going to help you guys. Coming over the back. It's again, a very good design. This Velcro, it's very strong. And the closing mechanism, it looks simple, but it's very good quality. Uh, comparing with others, those flimsy flaps over here and the, at the bottom and then the ones, uh, the ones at the top, they, they don't cover everything. Uh, this, it covers pretty much everything and it also uh, closes it very, very well. You're not going to get water inside over here and it's got a nice, nice cool look. Coming over in the back, uh, those are the, the ramp skid seats where you hook up your ramps. Uh, this side, pretty simple. We got the, uh, the long uh, bar that we're gonna lift the tail up and then we got one toolbox, which is enough. Right now, let's go ahead and open it and I'll show you a few things. We're gonna go inside, I'll show you a few things about it and then uh, we're gonna slide it so you, you're gonna 
see those nice metal wheels, what they can do. Let's pop this open, get this out. Very, very simple, very simple. Same thing on this side. Pop the Velcro out, take it out. Now we gotta go, go ahead and get this uh, long crank tail key. Same thing, good quality. Coming over to the back, we're gonna insert into this square pipe. And let's go lift it up. Now, coming over with me, I'll show you the inside. This is a A-frame style lock-in mechanism. And the reason that we chose to go with this A-frame is this is gonna put tension right here. The standard system would put tension at the bottom, but because this is such a high unit, we wanna put tension in the middle in order to stretch the top very well. Uh, you're gonna see some others, they put tension at the bottom only, the top is not gonna be stretched. So it's gonna be a little wobbly, especially when you put a heavy load right in the middle. The trailer's gonna be almost straight, and then it is gonna be wobbly. This very last section, very, very wobbly. See those, uh, those are uh, uplift bows. This is called the double uplift because they're two. You could get it with four or six. Two, it's kind of standard, and those are, again, good quality. Uh, what those do, they, they push up, and they don't let the water to stay on top. And it should be like this, like any, like your house. It, it, the water should drain on the sides. Another unique feature from load covering solution is the double protection. So you see this extra tarp over here. It is going to protect the corners of your main tarp, not to rub into it. You've seen others that after two, three years, those corners are gonna get rubbed into and then it's gonna, it's gonna create a hole. So this is another good thing that uh, load covering solution thought about. The front bulkhead on the inside, it's got a chain rack and a chain tray. So you're gonna put here your binders and the chains and they're gonna sit over there in the little tray. The height that I was talking about outside, I mentioned that this is um, 104 inches inside. What that means, that means that from the bottom of the trailer, from the floor of the trailer, up to the top here, you got 104 inch. That means if you take a load that's 104, you're gonna be able to close it. If you think of a container, you can fit a container in here. Uh, so anything like that, it is going to fit. Uh, you get the advantage. The regular uh, flatbed, it would be 98. That would be general. This being 104, you get the six inches more, then this is gonna help you. And yeah, you do have to pay a little more in the beginning, but you're gonna make your money. Uh, just, the, just in the first year, you're gonna make the money uh, that you're paying more for the trailer. And then think about when you're gonna sell it, you're gonna take that money back again. So you have a a higher resale value with the low profile flatbed. Let's go on the back and then we're gonna open it up. We got the key over here. Again, everything is made very, very simple. Just gonna, it's a screw, screw operation, screwdriver operation here, very easy. Get this thing open from both sides. Here's the first done. Let me go on the other side. Here we go. And we're just gonna push it. You're gonna see very, very easy. This, this is the way that any tarping system, it, it should work. You should be able to push it with one hand, no problem. Slice them nice and easy. Now, because it's open, you can see a little bit more what this rail does. You see it's got about three quarters of an inch extra over here on the rail. So this is gonna protect your wheels and your track not to get damaged. So this, this thick aluminum 
is not gonna get damaged so easily comparing with others. Now, I mentioned the wheels are metal wheels. Here you can see the wheels. Each cart, each cart is gonna have two wheels. They're both metal. These have lifetime warranty. They're not gonna get damaged, they're not gonna crack. You won't have problems with those wheels. This is for, for long term. Now we're gonna push this thing back. We're gonna unlock the front. See how easy it closes? You just have this little handle. And by the way, this little handle has got two things. One thing, it's a handle that you can pull on it. But the second thing, this is gonna act like a brake. So you see your little wheel over here? You're gonna take this little, little thing and put it on the wheel and guess what this is going to act like a brake this is a stopper so this has got double function a lot of people don't know this fact gonna get this closed up over here and let's go in the front and i'll show you that uh, airlock mechanism how easy it is to open it up so the airlock mechanism is just one knob two fingers operation Pull this up, that's it, it's open. Get it right, right on. I'm gonna let it slide so you guys can see how easy it's going to slide. As a bonus, I'll show you what those ramps can do and I'll show you the instructions. Number one would be to come here to the manual dump valve dump the air out from your uh, bags so the trailer is going to be lowered to the ground we're going to do that first and then take the ramps you think you think they heavy yes they heavy but they're about 120 pounds each can i lift it yes i can lift it Remove those pins. Second pin out. Set it up. Block it. Let's get the second one. Let's get this and get it locked. And then let's bring our vehicle. Gotta check on the sides really quick. And we are in. So with everything that I uh, showed you about this extreme trailer with the load covering solution, tarping system, I hope I convinced you this is one of the best products. We do sell those and others here. We're an extreme dealer and we sell those uh, kind of trailers all the time. Customers are very happy. They call us for more. Thank you.